Hey guys, and welcome back to XCOM. When we last left off, we were preparing um, for the final fight. We did just do a large ship, which was more painful than I thought it was going to be, to be honest. Ten days out for him. Fred Flintstone's 21 days out. Sonic is three days out. And Gab Nugget is 30 days. She's a month out. Oh. Okay, um, also manufacturing more magnetic armor, which is fine. I think what we're going to do now, guys, uh, go to base, equip submarine, refuel and cool. We're just going to bide our time and we're going to wait because I think we're just going to get guys injured, to be honest. We will take out craft when and where we can. Uh, Barracuda, four, go for it. But I don't think we. Uh, yeah, it's fine. Uh, return to base. I don't think we really need to worry too much. Um, it's heading that way. Barracuda, eight. Yeah. Where are you heading? You're heading towards us. You can be destroyed. That's fine. Yeah. So we are. Very large dreadnought. Uh, let's bring the dreadnought down with the Leviathan. We're going to save it first, though, because if we lose the, the Leviathan, it is game over. <laughs> that goes without saying. <laughs> Yeah, she's gone. She's had enough. No. We don't need to do it. We'll let them perish on the floor. On the seabed floor. Take it out. Nice. Good kill. Right, it's RTB, guys. Thing is, if we keep doing missions, we'll just... We'll never get there. Uh, large... Oh, man. There's so much going on here. Intercept... Barracuda, go for it. I know you're rearming, but you don't need to. As long as we keep shooting these guys down, um, we should be fine, to be honest. Ooh, he's... Yep, yeah, okay. Uh, ooh. We don't care. We don't care. We just want to make our way towards the endgame now. Unfortunately, the end game is very, 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 very difficult. Um, yeah, if you thought that some of the other missions we've had have been hard. <laughs> <laughs> Two part missions are fucking savage. They are relentless and unfair and, and brutal. So they made the, the last mission a three part mission. Yeah, that's right. Three parts. And uh, on the final part, which is huge, you can't save. So, yeah, you, you kind of have to. <sighs> I don't want to say get lucky, um, but you have to get lucky, uh, basically. So let's go for Gorse Rifle, Cannon, MC Disruptor. Uh, I'm, where is it? Where is it? Disruptor. Disruptor Pulse Ammo. Why can I never find this thing? All items. Uh, what would it be called? Weapon, heavy weapon systems. Yeah, there we go. All right. Um, right. Yes, we want to build another one of those. Everyone. Small, very deep. Destroy it. Get it out of our sea. <laughs> I was gonna say airspace, but. Get it out of our sea space. If you can. 
Yeah, you can. Man, <coughs> seas are certainly coming alive. <sighs> we are toasting them, though. How much fuel did you have left after that? Uh, quite a lot, actually. All right. Okay. Displacer. Nice. Okay, so everything is basically done here. We just need to generate cash. As much cash as we can get our grubby little hands on. For no reason, really, than I guess XCOM needs cash. Although XCOM doesn't really need cash. XCOM's pretty loaded. To be honest. Very large dread dreadnought. Uh, where was the other one? There. Let's get the Manta to go for it. Don't know if the Manta is going to be able to handle it. But I guess we're about to find out. Lost it. Um... Hmm. Return to base. Doesn't matter. They can expand the colony all they like, but their time running around as they please is almost at an end. It really is. We're going to keep shooting down their ships the best we can. Keep holding them off. Because surely their ships are not unlimited. But who knows? I mean, I'm obviously uh, metagaming here a little bit, but obviously their ships are unlimited. It's fun to believe that they actually do not have unlimited resources. But you can see the escalation that we're starting to get now. They're everywhere. Are we going to miss that one? Nope, we're not. We caught him. Bring it down. This is obviously quite expensive for the aliens, but I don't really know how the alien economy works. I don't know if this actually is expensive for them. Right, wounded. Four days. Gab Nugget was the worst. 24 days. Okay. 24 days. It's moving over this way, really. Let's get Barracuda 6. Gonna miss it though, I think. Yeah. Uh, return to base. We'll probably pick it up on another sonar somewhere a little bit later on. Yep, there we go. Um, Barracuda, get it. Let's just try and keep the uh, herd of aliens at bay, reacting to them as and when we can. I don't know how many points we get for shooting down aliens. I have no idea. That's fine. Uh, return to base. That's fine. Small. Um, go get them. Now, Manta 7 has had uh, some really good kills in the past. Let's get you after him as well. Nice little intercept plop locked in. Oh, he's quick. He's very quick. Oh, we did get him. I actually have my doubts. I thought the fucker was going to escape. Alright, not bad. Not bad. Um, financially, we're, we're kind of in a strange place. Um, I would have thought we would have. Oh! That's because we're <laughs> building them and not, you know, selling them. That was silly. Let's sell all of those. Right, and talking of that, what else can we sell? We don't need all those. Definitely don't need the rifles or the ammo. Hold on to that. Don't. Oh dear. 
Don't need those. Definitely don't need all these. It's just ridiculous. I'll hold on to the ZR bite for now. Oh my god. Oh my god. Vibro blades we can't use. Thermic lances we can't use. Oh, it's so annoying that some of this stuff is bugged out because some of it's really fun to use. It really is. Uh, we've really got fucked over with this. There's a lot of bugs in these games, sadly. Um, Aquaplastics, bring that back down to like 800. I mean, technically, by selling this stuff, we are actually supplying the world with uh, decent armor. Well, decent equipment, really. So. Ooh. That's only a small. Um, should we try and catch a small? Should we try it? Just for funsies. What's actually on board? Aquatoids! Aquatoids! Okay. Fuck you, Aquatoids. Uh, we didn't put our tank back on, did we? We did not. <laughs> well, this mission just got a shit ton more interesting, I guess. Right, where's all the equipment? Who's standing on all the goodies? Rocco. So the equipment is here. Alright. No. Well, this is going to be a pain. Uh, shuffle around. Now, even though we only have Aquatoids to deal with, we don't want to take any risks. Not really. Not if we can help it anyway. Right. So that's okay. Okay. That's better. That's better. It's not perfect, but it's better. It'll be interesting to see if they use any mind powers. Oh, Rocco sees one. Fry's ass. Barry Burton. What about you? See anything? Nah. Nah, Baza, the big man himself, sees nothing. Hmm, what are these sneaky little fuckers doing here, I wonder? Right, Jill. Trade places with Rocco. Because we need more light. And go hide in the boat. Back to the boat. Man, this is quite interesting. We haven't seen these guys in a very long time. I mean a very long time. Uh, okay. Alright, let's get some scouting done. I mean, there's not going to be many of these guys out here. I mean, even though they're aquatoids, there's still enough to fuck our shit up. Because it only takes one lucky shot, remember? There's the ship. It's not what we wanted to see, really, but... Okay. Yep, not what we wanted to see. Uh, and also, the ship is bigger than I thought it was going to be. Bugger. Um, okay, that's fine. That's fine. We have the firepower to deal with this quite easily. 
but... Oh, God damn it. Luckily, Aquatoids are like the weakest soldiers. They've got like the lowest accuracy and all that good stuff. Um, but they're still, you know, a sonic cannon is still a sonic cannon. And it can still hurt you. Jill. I don't understand why Jill misses so frequently with her accuracy as high as it is. It is irksome, to say the least. But she's got a good arm on her, luckily. Um, right, Barry. I don't really want Barry to go too far out because Barry doesn't have any flares. Iceman does though. So light that up, Iceman. Nice. Let's get the rest of the... Well, not the rest, but let's get some more of the goon squad out. Keep everyone nice and spaced out if we can. Now we can get everybody up high. Now the main thing you want to worry about with uh, the Aquatoids is they really do like their psychic abilities. Ooh. Which I was really hoping we weren't going to have to worry about. But it appears the AI has kind of found its psychic abilities, which is a bit cheap if you ask me. Ooh, if we can't use psychic abilities, the AI shouldn't be able to. But I mean, I guess it's a bug. And bugs don't always work in a fair, proper manner, do they? Ooh, we are stacking these bodies. Stacking those bodies. Eggman, move up. Can't be many of them left now. Iceman. Yeah, there really can't be too many left. Uh, really don't like how dark it is over there. Jill's used all of her chemical flares. She has... Iceman's got a couple left. Hock one over there, buddy. Oh, what a throw that was. What a throw that was. This guy could have been an Olympic champion. Maybe that was what his career was. Maybe that's where he was going. Before these aliens decided to turn up and, uh, you know, fuck with the wrong species. Um, right. Rocco. Get another one out up here, please. Please, please, out of range. What kind of manzy pansy are you? Alright, start getting you to move up as well, because we don't want you to die. We don't want any of you guys to die. Let's get everyone up high. Including you, but you can't, because you don't have enough to use, because you suck. Alright. Guessing all that's left is inside the base, uh, inside the sub. It is a guess. My guesses aren't exactly great at the best of times, as we have seen countless times before. But this has been a pretty solid wipe so far. But, you know, anything can happen in XCOM. Literally anything could happen. It's kind of what keeps it exciting. You literally, you think you're fine. You think you're laughing. And then some cheeky bastard out of nowhere just blindsides you and wastes a load of your guys. Uh, where are you? There are you. 30. Hmm. 36 is needed. Barry? Can you do it? Of course you can. Barry freaking Burton. 
Barry can't do it, then we're fucked. Right, Rocker, you got one chem flare left. Light this area up, please. Anything? No, looks like we're okay. At least we're okay for now. This is a really frickin' big map as well, considering. I don't like it. No, sir. I don't like it at all. Right. Nothing. Definitely inside, I think. Which is problematic. You know, it is problematic. But, them's is the brakes. Okay. So that's <laughs> oh. Barry's injured. Oh, Barry. He's only got a fucking disruptor rifle as well, by the look of things. Should have tickled you, boy. I should have tickled you. What did that do to your armor? Left armor at him. Ah. That was unpleasant. Who's got a med kit? Okay. Can you get to Bazaar as soon as you can, please? I mean, that's it. You lure yourself into a full sense of security. You play with feathers, you get your ass tickled. That's just the way it is. Um, I guess technically we could just pick up a chemical flare off the floor and throw it again. But let's not be uber sloppy, shall we? I mean, we've been sloppy enough, but... Yeah, movement inside. All of that lovely as you bite. Get that there, just... Because, calms my anxiety. You know, if I had anxiety. Um, right. It's definitely one thing I don't miss, anxiety. Right, okay. We'll have to get our light carrier. Eggman, soaked it. Eggman soaked it. Ooh, Eggman missed. He fired and he missed. Literally cooked this dude's feet. Lara, make it happen. Right in the head. Made its head literally explode into a thousand gooey pieces. Oof. Whilst the remains are cascading and showering down. Ah, Leon, you disappoint me. Leon. Leon. Leon, where are you? Leon, where are you? You're actually giving me a headache now, Leon. You're telling me you can't throw that there. Unbelievable. Actually unbelievable. What about now? I can't believe. Ooh. I cannot believe. Ah, no good. He's got shots, faceless. But can you hit? No. What about anybody over here? See him and hit him? No. Baza? What about you? I know you're wounded. No line of fire. Now oh, we 
got a shot on him, but it didn't really do an awful lot of much. Rocco. Seems it's just an aquatoid. We need 18 to throw it. Rookies in this game. Oh. It's so bad. Well, let's see if we can move up a little bit. Come on, love. Yes! Nice. Nice shot. Very nice. Lara got some nice improvements there. So did Rocco. Okay, but we did get some more wounded people. And the way the wounds work in this game is a bit strange because I bet that's pushed us back quite significantly. Wounded, yeah, 28 days. 15 days. 18 days. 18 days, and he barely had any injuries at all. 11. Oh, Sonic can come back on. Sonic was a bit of a joke. Uh, Gav is still 20 days away. Sonic was a bit of a joke, but Fleet Supply Cruiser. He actually did kind of prove his own worth. Come on. Sensor contacts. Nice. Ooh. Ooh. Definitely want to try and destroy that. We are going to save it just in case. Because if we lose the Leviathan, we lose everything. Literally shitting their pants. Okay. Alright, let's go back to Equip Submarine Leviathan. Uh, yeah, let's get you back on board. Space used 18. So we're 8 Aquanauts down. Sonic, welcome back. Iron Maiden, welcome back. Izumu, welcome back, I guess. So I think you're the new one, actually. Damage, 30%. 30% damage takes 16 days. It's interesting. It takes longer to repair this thing than it takes to actually build a new one. At least that's the way it feels. Come on. Contact. Kill it. Fuck it up. Get it out of my space. Okay. It's Christmas Day. Christmas Day. Christmas Day, and it's time to run the Leviathan again. Uh, last name. Should we do another Dreadnought? I mean, that's a spicy motherfucker right there. We are going to get injuries. Um, we just are. Oh my. 
but this thing is kind of a mother load. You don't need that. You don't deserve to have that. Bloody rookies grabbing the biggest guns that they think they can hold. Weapon systems like that are earned, buddy. Okay. So what can we see straight off the bat? Tazuth. Emma, that's not really the opening salvo that we wanted. That's more like it. Right. Okay, guys. And with that, I think it's time to end the episode. I couldn't resist a big, delicious, fat, juicy target like that. I couldn't do it. I, I, I had to go for it, guys, you know? Like, one does not simply back away from a, a sitting duck like this, especially a, a succulent, well-basted, sweet, tender-fleshed duck like this. One must exploit it. Okay, tentacoolants are going to be an issue. Who am I kidding? Everything's going to be an issue on this mission. Uh, this mission is going to be rough. But that's okay. That is okay, because we have the best of the best here. And before I get too many turns in... Died. Ouch. 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 Ow. Fuck. Um, so, before we get too many turns in, oh, we just lost Patricia and somebody else, which I'm not happy about. I did say this one was going to be messy, guys. Um, yeah, I did say this one was going to be messy. This is probably going to be our final uh, sub before we just boom towards the end game anyway. Because I keep saying that. And we're just going to keep doing subs, getting people injured, blah, 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 blah. So we're going to draw a line in the sand. This is going to be our final sub. So, fuck. Thanks for watching, guys. And as always, until next time.